mtazamaji wa Sam TV kwa sikio leo ningependa tuweze kuwaletea mwigizaji hodari anayefahamika kama Louis. Je, ulikuwa unajua kwamba mchekeshaji ama mwigizaji huyo kwa majina yake kamili anajulikana kama Sir Brian Ogana ambaye kwa siku ya leo atatuelezea mbona Maria Season 2 haikuweza kurejea. Na je, wakati ambapo haikuweza kurejea kwa sasa hivi anafanya nini kwenye maisha yake? ili kuweza kupata unga unajua lazima uweze kufanya kazi ili uweze kupata unga ama uweze kupata chakula Aa, anafanya nini na mbona kipindi cha Maria season 2 akikuweza kurejea kwenye hewa ningekuomba mpenzi mtazamaji uweze kusubscribe na uweze kubonyeza alama ya kengele Pui kwenye studio zetu bado tupo naye hapa na nataka sasa tuzame baada ya Maria manake ulilipuka sana baada ya Maria sasa what happened Maria haijarudi kwa screen wewe hatujakuona kama umerudi kwa screen yes. uko wapi mm. All right. uh, immediately after Maria I decided I need two years break ah. yes reason being is uh, kama msanii ukifanya kazi na hiyo kazi iwe nzuri sasa zingine you need that time for your face to face off and then when you get another project you try and be better than the last project so that was the main idea why sijachukua most of the project that was why complain why 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 i needed that two years break at least need to lie hata need detox need the roll then next now when i get another uh, project now i can now fully concentrate because it's it's usually tricky mm. try to balance and be in a new shoe watu wakumbuka bado ule lui and still it's a challenge mm-hmm. watu wamejua lui 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 ni ngumu kutoka mm. but aside from that i'm a communication strategist so i consult for people i do move the communication strategy for them uh people even in probably uh in the political arena I seek for my service. I do consultation for them. And uh you know me quick in weka at least ni kwe busy. Mm. And that's why it's jakuwa very active. Uh watu wakisema umeenda wapi? Mbona tukuoni? Niko lakini I'm doing something aside from no acting acting. Ha, unajua umeshangaza. Siju kama hilo wa Kenya wengi ama waigizaji wengi wanafahamu. Mm-hmm. Hilo linatokea kule Hollywood. Mtu akipewa project after some time ana break kidogo. Oh yes, oh yes. Uh-huh. I, 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 lazima udi roll uh-huh. juu ukisema ukwe na that particular role. Sasa zingine that's why unaona watu wengi sana huenda wanakuwa wenda azimu cuz imekuingia na imekata kutoka. So lazima udi roll hiyo character ikutoke kabisa so that ukishika ingine hatutaona ule jamaa alikuwa anafanya kitu fulani mm. bali tutaona mtu tofauti na hilo nyingine ameishika mm. so every every professional actor lazima you the role kwa umekuwa ukikata yes. projects wanakualika wanakuambia lui hapa kuna script yes, yes. wanakualika kuchukua scripts umekuwa oh, ukikata yes, oh yes huh? nimekuwa nikikata hata tumekuwa <laughs> nimekuwa na shida sana watu wakisema ah ujamaa pengine anaringa na sikuringa wewe mwenyewe unajua mbona unafanya hivyo sikuringa niyo you want to de roll na pia at least ili kazi ulifanya pale mwanzoni at least hiyo iko kivyake so that ukishika nyingine iko totally different from what you do previously so that's why and are you now ready umefika ule wakati ambao oh, yes. unaisi kwamba oh, yes. saizi ukipewa script yes you're ready to hit oh, our yes. screens again oh yes after two years are done so yes now i can get another project and done with it kuna yote ulionayo mfukoni ama unayo sai uh, we are still in talks Uh, watu wame pitch a few scripts so we are still in talks uh, lazima pia najua you can't just take any other thing mm-hmm. lazima uangalie role gani inakufaa sana so that's we still in talks so when i see probably to kill and on this particular script or project then yeah we will run with it na una kama ume preempt ama kama umenisoma akili zangu maana mm-hmm. kilikuwa nataka sasa nikuulize yes. eh, ni role gani ambayo ukapewa leo mm-hmm. aah hawezi ukaifanya unasema asanteni sana uh, for now i think I, i'm up to the task mm. i'm up to the task of any challenge cuz <laughs> Naweza ifanya. Naweza ifanya. Bora hiyo storyline ina uzito fulani cuz storyline is everything. Uh-huh. Ina uzito fulani, mm-hmm. I will gladly do it cuz uh, I think for me right now is to challenge myself. Take a stereotype my character as ule jamaa wa mapenzi and that's it. So every other role ni hiyo inaegemea upande huo mmoja. Ah ah. Na kama hapo ndo uzito wako upo. 
ni sawa lakini sitaki kufanya story za mapenzi sana nataka at least pia mimi niji challenge nijue eh pia anaweza fanya hii mtu mbaya nataka niji challenge isikuwe tu ni yule mtu wa mapenzi mtu wa mapenzi basi yes mm-hmm. yeah kwa hivyo hakuna ile ambayo ume rule out hii mm-hmm. sitaweza hii mm-hmm. sitaweza mm-hmm. what is the most important thing ambayo unaangalia kwa script script storyline very important director very important cuz director anaweza kujenga ama anaweza kubomoa so hizo ni vitu mbili muangalia sana and then pia hiyo character yenye nafanicheze how is it hizo vitu tatu niki combine in any other script if itaniongelesha then i'll do that project lui unajua kwamba na nilikuwa nakuuliza because tumeona uh, and i know you know Uh, f- kwa mfano tu huwa tunazungumzia celebrities yes. be it football watu wa talent most of the time unakuta kwamba baada ya kungara ile ulingara pengine yes. ni mafootballers boxers yes. actors hata watangazaji wana muziki unasikia kwamba after some time hiyo yes. fame yote hana kitu mm-hmm. you know and uh, i don't know how wewe umeji u, u, you know most people wakitoka venye umesema yes. wakitoka nje ya acting unasikia tena maisha mwalipokia hawana yes. yes. namna True. wewe ume ume maintainaje because vile mm. umesema ukiwa maria you know the expectation oh, yes. Oh, yes. lifestyle yes. you know mm. ume maintainaje after hapo because ndio najua uko na biashara na kadhalika ili i'm just looking at it and say Where do people go wrong? Mm. Kiasi unasikia kwamba fulani amefika depression, yes. mm. tuchange. Anataka tuchangie, kwa mitandao. Na mpaka there was a, a Kenya ambaye alikuwa mm. si celebrity. Akasema yes. nyinyi celebrities mm. mnatubeba wana. Yes. Yes. Mnatubeba ujinga. Yes. We yes. support you on screens, mm-hmm. we support you with your projects. Yes. Alafu bado leo hii unaishiona pesa, sisi tena tuje tuchangie. Na ulikuwa yes. na make pesa nyingi kunishinda mimi mm. mkenya wa kawaida. Mm. Mm-hmm. For me to be this. Um, before you touch on any rule just know why am i doing this mm-hmm. that is very important because there is life after mm-hmm. any particular project itaisha at one point so i usually tell my close colleagues for you to sustain yourself get something that will be regenerating something back to you because ukweli usemwe ukisema kenya hii ukisema you will depend on artistry you won't survive mm-hmm. that's the honest truth so you have to have something that again if ikiisha bado utarudi kwa hii plan nyingine and you will sustain yourself because mm-hmm. most mo, mo, most most of the time most of the artists usually just do a project alafu pesa usani ni tamu sana ju inaingia and most of the time it's not even taxed mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. ikiingia ni tamu so uno na iko haizi isha but you don't plan hapo mbele itakuwaaje that's where most people usually go wrong but if we go back to the drawing board na mtu aweze ku plan na jipange aseme okay fine hii pesa inaingia ni kiasi fulani hii percentage nitaeka hapa itafanya kitu fulani 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 then we will we will kill this thing of oh kipindi fulani imeisha nimerudi nichangie 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 that's why we usually go wrong we don't plan mtazamaji baada ya kuweza kusikiliza interview hiyo ya Louis amu kipenda sa Brian Ogana Je, yeah, unaona kwamba aliweza kuchukua maamuzi mema? Nimeweza kukuachia commenting section, cheza nayo tuweze kupata maoni yako.